Hello, all you wonderful people, my name is Barry Infos and welcome to a new Bully 100% walkthrough video. Today I have two missions for you guys. The first one is called, of course, Character Sheets, as you can see on the screen, which is available after Halloween, so complete Halloween, and we have access to this mission. The next one is also a side mission, this is a side mission, and the other one is also a side mission, it's called the Diary, and it's unlocked after Beatrice's first mission, which I did in previous episodes, which was a main mission, however this one is not a main mission, so you can do this even after in chapter 2, even after a long time, but I'm gonna do them right now. And also afterwards, after you complete Halloween, you can lockpick two lockers and get two extra masks for your wardrobe, which of course is what I'm also gonna do. So let's start character sheets. The first mission for today. Bunch of thieving jerks! What's up, Melvin? Ah, greetings. Talking about me, bitch? Jimmy, listen! Some ruffians took it upon themselves to steal my grottos and gremlins character sheets and won't return them. We're playing tonight, the whole situation is untenable. Grottos and gremlins? Boy, you are sad. Sad? I'm distraught! Role-playing is the high point of human achievement. Like Pokemon cards. In fact, upon reflection, I am prepared to offer a bag of groats to the fair knight whomsoever recovers these precious screens. Uh-huh. Do you accept the quest? Hell yeah. How much? Ten groats. What? I mean ten bucks. Wait here. And you can have your pick of my wenches. Great. <laughs> it's like Gwent. Oh, I wanna play Gwent again. You made me sad because I wanna play Gwent. Goodbye. <laughs> anyway, we have four choices as you can see. We have to do all of these to complete the mission. You can do them in any order you want. I'm just gonna go from here gonna start with these guys. Now these guys, um, this side mission they, they give you, the, the mini game they give you is very difficult if I don't pull it off right now. I will restart the mission and show you what exactly happens if you manage to win this mini game. What is it exactly? Well, right, you got something of Melvin's. Give it up. All right, I'll give it to you. You beat my friend in a little game. He kicks you in the nuts. You kick him in the nuts. Cool. Weirdos. Okay, so you have to try to get up. If you do, they drop the card. If you don't, you have to beat them up. It is very difficult to pull off at 60 FPS. I have 60 FPS currently because I have it unlocked. In the original game, if you don't have any mods installed, you're gonna have 30 FPS. So, you're gonna have a much better time. So, for this next one, I suggest you prepare this or this, the firecrackers, or the super slingshot, because the next guy is gonna try to escape and he's gonna drop marbles at you, so just shoot him from a distance and you'll be done with this guy. If you don't shoot him immediately, you're gonna have to chase him around the whole school, guys. He's gonna make a full lap of the school, make a second lap of the school, and return here and gonna try to fight you. And he's gonna also drop marbles on the way, so yeah, do not do that. Just be quick, take your super slingshot, and you'll be good. And this one just have to beat up. You can shoot, of course, or you can just hit from close. It is very easy. Drop, drop the card, mister. Don't you forget it. Okay, you got it. And the next one, so also you have to just beat up. Pretty easy stuff. Let's go. There's a fight here too. Ugh, oh, all these guys. Also, by the way, these bullies have zero respect for you. And after you unlock the next chapter, they're gonna have respect, which is really helpful, by the way. So just you wait and you'll be good with them. Currently, it's very annoying. Yo, what's up? So these bullies are torturing our poor, poor uh, nerds. <laughs> poor, poor nerds. Hey, what's up, bully boy? Die! This guy's gonna help you or try to help you, even though he's not really helping you. Return the sheets to Melvin. This is pretty much it for the mission, guys. Pretty easy, pretty quick. 
But yeah, about the bullies, you can see that you can go right over here, you can see bullies, the respect is zero, so when they see you, anywhere they see you, they're gonna try to hit you. So you should try avoiding the bullies in chapter 1, especially after a few missions, because after a few missions, the respect plummets to zero, before that is not exactly at zero, but yeah, after chapter 2 is unlocked, which is gonna happen in the next episode, they'll like you again. Oh, my precious documents, thank you sir, you are a noble man indeed. Just give me the money, Melvin. Yo oh yeah, my wenches! You get 10 bucks, which is quite a bit in bully. It's like getting 10,000 bucks in a GTA game, I guess. So what do you get as a reward, you may ask? Nothing really. You just get a few sheets, because it's called character sheets. Can I make this? Oh, damn! Nice! Did you just see that? Okay, let's go here. To my dorm and check out this these are the character sheets it even says character sheets on them if you zoom in pretty hard to see but if you zoom in you can see the character sheets so as you can see the next mission is just help gary which is the second to last mission in chapter one and that one immediately starts the last mission in the game the diary however is gonna also pop up at night time it's a nighttime mission so after seven o'clock you can do that mission. Before that, I'll just walk around, harass some bullies, probably get a kiss from somebody, and I'll be back with you guys. And welcome to the girls' dorm, get away from me. You should do this mission as soon as possible, as soon as it's available. Just do this, look away, and it's gonna spawn right over here at 7 o'clock. Start the diary. And she's crying again. Hey, Beatrice, what's wrong? Two things. Firstly, my cold sores are totally acting up what? again. What? Ew, gross. Secondly, Ew. Mr. Hatrick saw me writing in my diary during class, and he took it and he locked it in his desk. Good. And he says he's going to give it to the principal tomorrow. If anyone sees what's in there, I will just die. It's really personal. Yeah, well, nothing like having the whole school know your deepest secrets. Makes your teenage years go by in a flash. How's that my problem? Yeah, well, you'll soon find out. Me? Why? In the diary, I talk a lot about you and me. What? There is no you and me. Yeah, yeah, there is. See, first you rescued my notes from Mandy, and then we fell in love, and oh, you brought me flowers, what? and wrote me poetry, and Why? showed this kinder, sensitive side that soon the whole world is going to know about. We're like doomed lovers. Enough. OK, I'll get your book back. Then we can kiss. The cold sores aren't contagious once they start to scab over. But they're currently contagious, right? You don't want to do anything with you. Ew, disgusting. Anyway, like I said, do it as quick as possible because if you do it way later, you're gonna pass out after a while, so do not. Also, go on the back side. You could have taken a shortcut, but it's okay. I'll not take a shortcut. Let's go on the back right over here this is how you enter from the back it's current night time so there's there shouldn't be any people in the school except for some prefects sometimes there's also a grotto cart over here you have to collect these also but i'm gonna collect them later on he also glitches out over here but don't worry he's gonna find his way okay check the math room it's on this level so try to avoid the people you see this guy over here, shh. Doo -doo -doo, doo -doo -doo. This is the first room you have to check out. However, dun dun dun, it is locked. Let's go down. Uh, somebody also kissed me, by the way, that's why I have so much health, and he saw me, of course! Yeah, try to avoid doing that, because... Uh-oh, uh-oh, <laughs> he didn't saw me. Both of them saw me, it's okay. It's okay, I will turn them. I'm quick. <coughs> Speedy Jimmy. Okay, good. You gotta go over here. Just enter the room, make sure nobody sees you. And collect the sheet. Let's read it together like the good boys we are. Let's see. That new Jimmy boy is so bad. Bad teeth, bad hair, bad smell, bad attitudes, and yet... 
There's something about him that is just so alluring. I told Bucky about how I felt and he didn't seem happy at all. That makes me a little sad because Bucky is being such a great friend. I hate to think that something or someone in his life is not treating him well. Oh, I knew it. I walked by him today and he looked at me. He looked at me. He's such a free, a radical... Asshole, uh, how I would love to pair his electrons. The whole four of us making sweet organic love, I mean chemistry, just seems a sense shivers down my spine. Oh, she wants the D in the J. J's D. <laughs> Whatever she wants, I don't know. How old is she? Anyway, let's go. What you have to do is just get the hell out of here, <laughs> he almost saw me, mm, there's no good way of getting out, let's go out from here, yeah and if you do it way later you're gonna be out of curfew or in curfew or whatever it's called and they're gonna chase you as soon as they see you outside so do not do that, uh oh, no, go away, stop chasing me, let me complete my mission. Much. Much obliged. Much, of course. And you get 20 bucks in this mission, guys, and also a chick. She has fallen in love with you. Which is amazing. Indeed, it was. So cool, so cool. Also, another tip you can pick flowers. You have 10 inventory slots. Something I forgot to say in previous episodes, as you can see, I have 10 full, whoops, not here, inventory. Uh, if you go over here, yep, you can see 10 out of 10 flowers. So let's go back to my dorm and I can show you what you get as a reward, apart from the 20 bucks, of course. You get something special, it is Beatrice in your room, woohoo! Are you excited? Are you excited to see Beatrice in your room? There she is, unfortunately. <laughs> she's not in the room, she has a picture of herself in the room. And you can kinda read it. So hard to aim in this game, aim your character, your camera. Beatrice, yeah. She has a nice kiss and she likes you now. So, like I said, you get the character sheets and this picture too. So. Let me show something else, like I said, I'm gonna sleep and go to the school and pick some lockers. Okay, so <laughs> look at it. Okay, so what you do is just basically find a locker, any locker anywhere in the school or in the gym or whatever and just pick it. It's almost never gonna be the first locker you pick, but it could get lucky. Did I get lucky? Yes, oh my goodness, that's the first locker I picked. Got the werewolf mask, which is the first mask I wanted to... Oh, look at this. Oh, I got, oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> yep, I had to do it. Anyway, basically, you pick a locker, you pray that you're gonna get the mask, and you're gonna get the mask. No, go away. No, no, no. I'm not gonna pick up this locker. No, no, no. <laughs> Let's go. Am I gonna get lucky again? I highly, highly, highly doubt it, but we shall see. And... Nope. I'll continue picking lockers until I eventually get the second mask too. And again, it's completely random, it could take you days. It's not a specific locker, it could be any locker in the school, in the gym, wherever. So keep looking and eventually you're gonna find it. Oh, there we go! I checked out like four lockers maybe and I got the bandit mask too, woohoo! Okay, so we got two masks, let's just go to my dorm and I'll show you how they look like. Okay, here's the bandit mask, mm-hmm, very very nice, I quite like it, I look like a bandit, <laughs> obviously. And here's the werewolf mask too, werewolf mask too, it's a hard word to say but here it is, I look snazzy. So majestic, so scary, Ooh. But yes, let me repeat, after Halloween, doesn't matter which chapter it is, if you pick any lockers, you could get lucky and get the two masks. So do it whenever you want, and good luck, it could take you days. 
For me it took just maybe 5-6 lockers. So guys this concludes this video, thank you so much for watching, in the next episode we are gonna unlock chapter 2, because we have just 2 missions in chapter 1 left. I am very excited because after we do, we unlock so many different side missions, it's unreal. So stay tuned, thank you for watching again and a special thank you to my lovely channel members and patrons. LMP Racing, Alex Chavez, How's the Chowder, Max Robinson, Smokey O, SMRJ, Paris Bruce Lane and everyone else on the screen. Thank you once again. Again. 